Hello there, it's your boy Kara, and today I want to talk to you about AEW Fight Forever one more time. This video will be short. Basically, there's been news going around that AEW Fight Forever will be available day one on the Game Pass, which would mean it would be available to more than 25 million or around 25 million freaking players, which sounds like an awesome idea. However, very recently, these rumors have been proven to be false by AEW themselves. As you can see here, if you go to the official AW Games Twitter page, they have confirmed them uh, confirmed this themselves, so let me just read it to you. They talked about showcasing the game as well next week, but we'll get to that right after we read this. So basically, this also seems like a good time to share that we don't anticipate AEW Fight Forever being part of any monthly gaming subscription services. No, no Xbox Pass, basically. AW Fight Forever will be available in your store and yada yada yada. You can buy it on Steam or many places. Available for all platforms. Honestly, I was surprised and I was kind of shocked because you know how people feel about uh, games coming out on Xbox Pass, uh, Xbox Game Pass, like immediately. Kind of makes the game seem like minor leagues, right? It makes him see makes it seem bad. But I was still very receptive to the idea, and I think this is something they should definitely do in the future before the WWE 2K series. Let the fans buy the game first, like after after a year, put it on Xbox Game Pass, and let many other people experience this. Because you know how I've become a wrestling fan, how I've been watching wrestling <laughs> after 10 years. Because I saw a pro wrestling game on the PS2. I think it was SmackDown vs Raw. And that's it, the first ever SmackDown vs. Raw. What I'm trying to say here is that AEW really has a lot of potential new audience here. If they were ever if they ever told chose to do this. Like I'm sure a lot of people will be bored. Oh look, a new game came out. AEW. I guess it's a fighting game. It looks interesting. Let me check it out. And if the game is fun, which from the looks of it it is, like with Xbox Game Pass, you'll have a lot of people who don't even care about wrestling, AEW, WWE, but you know stumble onto the game and just like an awesome awesome business idea like i said if i was AEW, i would just be looking at ways that i could do this before wwe just so i can have that title you know first ever wrestling video game on a you know gaming subscription thingy great for marketing great for business in general and i'm sure after this whole debacle after all the rumors and after how people talk about this even if they didn't think about doing this i think now they they have this in mind and i think yeah, it just makes sense. They'll get money for putting their game in the subscription uh, model. And if they do this after a year, it'll be towards the end of the game's life cycle. So they can bring in more players now and keep the game alive. Not only that, but it'll be great for them to start working on their, you know, next title. A sequel or whatever. So like I said, it just makes so much sense. Now leaving this aside, let's talk about the other news that we've got today. Hang tight for a new exclusive AEW Fight Forever update next Saturday, November 19, during AEW Full Gear. I didn't even know AEW Full Gear was uh, that close. <laughs> That's wild. But you know for a fact that I'll be all over that I'll be uploading a video to my channel about that. And once we start getting some more concrete WWE 2K23 news, uh, I'm going to be all on that as well. So do subscribe to my channel if you want to be up to date with all the latest and greatest wrestling video game news. So it looks like they're finally starting the marketing again. And the whole Kenny Omega CM Punk debacle is behind them. So we should be seeing a lot more about AEW Fight Forever. And real soon we'll probably see a lot more about WWE 2K23 as well. So... Lots to look forward there. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you on the next one.